Okay, since I've been trying to go through some of the toys I picked up, here is a video of a uh, Black Cat JB75A mobile one tube uh, amplifier from back in the uh, heyday of CBs in the 80s. This may not be an original Black Cat, if it's not, it's a clone of the design. But this is the latest uh, that they probably made, or whoever made it. Um, if you notice, um, the circuit board's in it, and the layout's pretty clean and neat. And actually, this is a little bit older one without the circuit boards, even though this is a late one also. But uh, notice no circuit board, more of a rat's nest or hand-wired. Um, version of the same amp, same case, um, almost the same uh, pinout and all that other stuff. But here's the uh, updated circuit board one, um, very good condition I picked up and uh, uses 184.17 uh, tube which is a uh, high powered version of the 6L6 tube family. Uh, one tuber DC mobile amp not much to it on the front you got uh, just a power switch you rotate that black switch for power on this one which is the only one I've ever seen like that where all the rest of the black cats use a regular toggle switch for power on and off and got a regular toggle switch for standby uh, the bottom light shows um, power on and the uh, top light is going to show uh, RF power out when you key it down I got it hooked up to this little mobile radio here because uh, my big base station does a little bit too many watts for these one tubers and I didn't want to uh, kill it before it even had a chance and note that uh, this radio is only doing about two, two and a half watts maybe right now so I'm not putting a lot into it at first I didn't even think it was working because uh, I didn't get any dead key out of it but I forgot that uh, with low watts going in Black Cat might not dead key or lot or nothing at all. Right now we got it on standby and just the radio going into the watt meter. Yeah, we are on peak. Let me put it on average here. There you go. That's the two watts going in it. Hello, 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 hello. On average. Hello, hello, hello. Maybe swinging four and a half. So not putting a whole lot into it. Got to put it on standby, I mean on operate, off of standby. Key it down, that's that uh, wine. And that's my dead key with two watts going in. Nothing, basically. Audio, that's why I thought it wasn't working until I actually put modulation on this thing. So let me get off my uh, 20 watt scale before I break it, and that was even on average, mind you. And now we on the 200 watt scale. Audio. Audio on average. Hello, hello, hello. Audio. Doing about 40 watts. Hello, 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 hello. 35 average. And we're going to flip it to peak right quick. Audio. 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 Doing about 90 watts. Hello, hello, hello. Audio, audio, a little over 90, trying to hit 100 peak, hello, 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 audio, so that's going to be about it, ain't much, too much else to this little uh, jewel box or black cat JB75 modulator, the latest and the greatest with the uh, boards in it, updated look, uh, pretty clean, versus the uh, older one with uh, no boards and uh, the hand wired kind of look to it. Um, I'm kind of liking this. A lot of audio, a lot of swing with this. Um, makes a great little modulator or driver for a bigger boy, bigger box. Okay, that's it for the uh, Black Cat JB758.